China has unveiled what it calls the world's first long-endurance autonomous drone designed to independently locate and track submarines beneath the ocean. Known as the Wing Long X, this system can stay airborne for nearly two days while analyzing underwater activity using advanced sensors, sauna buoys, and onboard AI. In this video, we'll break down how it works and how it could reshape the future of large-scale ocean monitoring. China's announcement of what it calls the world's first autonomous drone capable of independently locating and tracking submarines marks a major shift in long-endurance ocean monitoring. This new platform, the Wing Long X, isn't just another addition to its drone family. It introduces an entirely new role for unmanned systems by blending long flight time, advanced sensing tools, and real-time onboard analysis. The most eye-catching part of the reveal is that China claims the drone can remain in the air for up to 40 hours continuously. That level of endurance is usually seen only in a few specialized aircraft, and even those require large crews and complicated schedules. The aircraft scale plays an essential role in what it can achieve. With a wingspan of more than 20 meters, roughly the size of a compact business jet, the Wing Long X has enough lift and internal volume to carry multiple sensors, communications equipment, and acoustic processing systems. This is a key reason why China can claim that the drone is built to identify underwater activity, such as submarine presence. A small drone simply would not have the equipment capacity needed to manage large quantities of acoustic and electromagnetic data. One of the most significant capabilities highlighted in the reveal is the drone's ability to deploy sauna buoys. These compact floating sensors are traditionally released only from large, crewed aircraft because they require trained operators to manage the acoustic data they collect. Sauna buoys pick up underwater sounds, capturing patterns and frequencies that can indicate submarine movement or other deep ocean activity. The Wing Long X takes this a step further by not only releasing the sensors, but also receiving and processing their data autonomously. Another important feature is its cruising altitude. Operating at around 10,000 meters, roughly 32,800 feet, the drone can cover a broad ocean area while staying above weather disturbances that might interrupt lower flying aircraft. What gives the Wing Long X its true significance is not just its ability to stay airborne for 40 hours, but its ability to understand what's happening beneath the ocean's surface with little to no human assistance. Tracking underwater activity has always been one of the most challenging tasks in maritime operations because the ocean is a complex acoustic environment full of unpredictable sounds. For an autonomous drone to confidently interpret that environment, it needs far more than long endurance. It requires advanced sensing, data processing, and intelligent pattern recognition. The process begins when the drone deploys specialized sauna buoys. These small floating sensors contain underwater microphones capable of picking up acoustic signatures that the human ear might overlook. Once released into the ocean, they begin capturing sound waves generated by vessels, machines, and natural marine processes. The Wing Long X then receives this acoustic data through secure transmission links and immediately feeds it into its onboard AI processing systems. Unlike traditional surveillance aircraft, which normally send raw sonar data to ground teams for interpretation, the Wing Long X uses deep learning models trained on extensive databases of underwater acoustic patterns. These models analyze frequency peaks, rhythmic movements, and signature variations to determine whether the sound belongs to marine wildlife, commercial vessels, natural disturbances, or potential underwater mobility, such as submarines operating at depth. This is where China's claim becomes astonishing. The suggestion that the drone can independently identify and track submarine-like activity using artificial intelligence. But the drone does not rely on acoustic data alone. It fuses multiple sensor streams, including radar reflections from the ocean surface, infrared mapping that detects temperature differences, and electronic emissions gathered from the surrounding area. Integrating this information creates a clearer picture of what is happening beneath the waves. For example, if an acoustic signal suggests underwater movement and radar simultaneously detects a disrupted surface pattern, the system can cross-validate the anomaly and improve classification accuracy. 
This type of multi-sensor fusion significantly reduces false readings, which historically have been a major challenge when monitoring the ocean. Natural events, like large sea creatures or shifting layers of cold and warm water, can mimic some acoustic patterns, causing confusion. The introduction of a drone that can remain airborne for nearly two days while autonomously interpreting underwater activity represents far more than a single technological milestone. It signals a shift in how nations may monitor the world's oceans. Traditional ocean surveillance has always relied on large, crude aircraft that require extensive preparation, high operating costs, and constant crew rotation. These limitations create natural breaks in coverage, leaving gaps where underwater activity might go unnoticed. The Wing Long X challenges that model by offering continuous, long-duration awareness without those constraints. One of the most impactful aspects of this technology is its ability to maintain persistent presence over key maritime regions. With a fleet of long-endurance drones rotating in shifts, large stretches of ocean could be monitored around the clock. This uninterrupted oversight helps identify patterns that would otherwise remain hidden. Seasonal vessel movement, recurring acoustic signatures, changes in shipping traffic, or unexpected underwater activity. Over time, AI systems trained on this data can detect anomalies more quickly and with greater accuracy. Another major implication is cost efficiency and scalability. A traditional maritime patrol aircraft can cost hundreds of millions of dollars and requires large support crews, specialized bases, and significant maintenance. An autonomous drone, by contrast, is far easier to deploy, reposition, or scale across multiple locations. This means that continuous ocean monitoring no longer depends on a handful of large aircraft. It can be distributed across multiple drones operating from simple ground facilities. More importantly, the Wing Long X reduces the burden on human analysts. Instead of being overwhelmed with raw sonar files or long-duration radar logs, specialists receive processed, intelligently filtered information. The drone's onboard AI analyzes the environment first, extracts meaningful insights, and then relays those results to operators. This accelerates decision-making, improves clarity, and minimizes the chance of human fatigue affecting analysis. Globally, this type of system marks the beginning of what could become a new architecture of ocean intelligence. Just as satellites transformed how we observe the atmosphere, autonomous long-endurance drones may transform how we observe the sea. The Wing Long X marks a major turning point in how ocean activity can be monitored, combining long-endurance, advanced sensors, and onboard AI to deliver continuous awareness over key maritime regions. Whether this platform becomes widely used or simply guides future designs, it highlights a clear shift toward autonomous systems that can interpret underwater environments in real time. As technology evolves, drones like this may help researchers, analysts, and maritime planners understand ocean patterns with a level of detail that was once impossible. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on space exploration and scientific discoveries and don't forget to leave a comment below. Also, you can visit our website, spaceinews.com. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.